Unlocking idioms, steamed to the gills. Hello and welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're diving into a colorful expression that might tickle your curiosity. Steamed to the gills. This idiom is not only vivid but also a great example of how English can be playful and imaginative. If you've ever wondered what it means or how to use it, you're in the right place. Let's get started and unravel the mystery together. Steamed to the gills is an idiom that paints a rather intriguing picture. But what does it actually mean? This phrase is used to describe someone who is extremely angry or furious. It's a vivid way to express a high level of annoyance or irritation, almost as if the person is so angry that steam could be coming out of their ears, or in this case, their gills, if they had any. You might be wondering, why gills? Well, this phrase uses the imagery of a fish, which breathes through its gills, to create a humorous and exaggerated effect. The idea is that someone is so angry that steam is coming out of every possible place, even their gills. It's an example of English idioms drawing on vivid imagery to convey feelings or states of being in a more impactful way. Now that you know what it means, let's look at how to use steamed to the gills in a sentence. This idiom is perfect for informal conversations and creative writing. Here are a few examples. After the meeting, Jenna was steamed to the gills about the decision that was made. He came home late again, and I was steamed to the gills waiting up for him. The customer was steamed to the gills after finding out his order would be delayed. Notice how the phrase effectively conveys a strong emotion, adding color and intensity to each sentence. While steamed to the gills is great for casual settings, it's important to remember it might not be suitable for formal contexts. In professional or academic writing, or in formal speeches, opting for clearer and more direct language to express anger or frustration is typically advised. Knowing when and where to use idioms is a key part of mastering English. We hope you enjoyed exploring the idiom, steamed to the gills, with us. Understanding idioms is a fantastic way to enrich your vocabulary and express yourself more vividly in English. Remember, language learning is a journey filled with discoveries. Keep practicing, stay curious, and don't hesitate to embrace the playful side of English. Until next time, happy learning!